It is one of those days, everybody, that I wake up with a mindset being thankful that you and I are going to do phenomenal. We're extremely early. And when somebody tells you you cannot make money in crypto because it's a complete scam, you show them this, what you're seeing on the screen right now. The good news is that bull market is here. But the better, best news is that we're nowhere even close to the end of this cycle. We're ending with a beautiful bull market and less than 60 days for the Bitcoin halving. When I see this, guys, we're nowhere even in green or orange or red. Simple moving average. This is what Michael Saylor uses. I remember hearing him speak when he comes to the long average. And we're still in the blue. We're still waiting for massive improvements in the price. And one of the things that I always like to remind my audience, whoever's watching right here, because I know people, people need to see the godlike candle pump to come and watch, to come and enjoy, to come and join the community. And it's totally fine. But for those who are brave enough to walk with me through everything, the dumps, the scams, the rock pulls, the pumps, the great moves. We're just making more money. We're just becoming way more prepared because it's not an easy arena here at cryptocurrency. One fun fact is that the last four to five days, we broke the $50,000. It is good, but it's not like we are still consolidated. Like This is decent, but starting on the 14th of this month right here, it means that at any time, Bitcoin can do a nice correction and go down to 48, 49, and that will be totally fine. Do not let the FUD titles, do not let mainstream media deceive you that, oh, here it goes to 30,000 again. Nah, it's just not going to happen. The last couple of days, the last couple of months, actually, and weeks, the bottom line of Bitcoin is this. You want to see it? I'll show you. We are destroying the expectations that a lot of bears had. But you know what? You want to know exactly what I mean? This is programmed already. This was already intended to happen. What we're seeing, guys, is just Bitcoin following the normal pattern of going low, then going high, and repeating history. And repeating history means that when you just understand that the bear market has ended and the bull market is starting, we are approaching, I cannot believe what I'm saying, but we're approaching the top of the price of Bitcoin and we are not even at Bitcoin halving yet, which is phenomenal. Guys, it's just unbelievable. That means that usually history repeats itself when it comes to Bitcoin. It takes a while, it takes four years. And in those four years, how many FUD titles Bitcoin is dead? We have seen what's going to end up happening, guys. And I'm going to go ahead and use my marker right here. We're about, probably going to go ahead and consolidate really nicely after the halving in the 60,000s. You rest assured when that ETF Ethereum passes. And then we have beautiful signals that BlackRock and Fidelity and all these big ones are still accumulating Bitcoin for their ETFs, I have no problem seeing Bitcoin skyrocket really beautifully to 90,000 for the first time still in 2024 or 2025. By that time, guys, uh, $100,000 sh shouldn't be a problem. Shouldn't be a problem. So the thing is, right now in the month, we are already seeing some three-digit level pumps. Like people and cryptos are doing great. The last year, we're starting to see some, you know, it was a mix of red mostly, but now we're finally seeing the green Caspa dominating lately, which is really exciting. If you go to the year, it's doing phenomenal thanks to Bitcoin stacks because of Bitcoin as well and ORD as well. So Bitcoin is really um, in the minds of a lot of people, right? And you know that I've been holding, here's, here are my positions. But I, I mean, what I told you in a few days, actually, I revealed this in a live, was my position in Tron. And that position is actually above five, almost 5%. My position in Ethereum is doing really well. And a little bit of Bitcoin that I have, it's also green, 17%. I love it. It is exactly the way we do crypto. And I'll tell you something, guys. I know. 
let's go to the weekly because that is that's a long time, right? Monthly. The weeks, how many do I have from here all the way here? I have eight weeks, 56 days, roughly for the Bitcoin halving. In those times, if we go 48, 47, and then 50, 50 to 60, then um, that's it, which is going to be accumulating more. But I'll tell you something. This, I'm going to sell before or by halving date because we're going to drop. Rest assured that let me explain what I'm saying. I totally believe, and I can be wrong, but this is just me speaking, my experience. We are headed to a correction of 20 to 15 to 25 percent because it always happens by the rumor, sell the news. And this time, I eventually, the date comes, drop. I haven't seen too many Bitcoin halvings where the price just explodes, same as the Bitcoin ETF, or could be same as the Ethereum ETF release. Just the news, the rumor, and then finally when it comes. So FYI, do not be deceived that we're going to just continue exploding. That could happen, but after whales take their profits, I believe that's the way it could go. And, uh, well, I'll be watching dubious speculation as always. Guys, don't forget to smash the like button. Consider subscribing to the channel. Turn on those notification bells as I'm pouring to you guys uh, the way I'm seeing things. There's obviously great momentum. There's obviously great ideas um, that we're sharing lately and we're just making the good money so far we're talking about different projects and i'm happy to see some of them here pumping doing really 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 well and you know what we're not gonna be disappointed in the long term look at this one that i always like to show because it you know I believe it's really important is the following you go back all the way to 2000 bam it's been 14 years. Here's the first one consolidated. Here is the second one consolidated. Here's the third one, which is the most recent 2020 consolidated. So it does apply what I'm saying for a while consolidation. And then after that, either we get to the red or the orange like here. So three times, one, two, three, red. You mean top maximum bubble territory. If we get ever a chance to repeat that, we're talking that Bitcoin can go all the way in the range of two hundred and seventeen to two hundred and ninety-five thousand dollars. Are you insane, guys? At that level, if you don't sell, you're banned from this channel. I'm just kidding, guys. Sell absolutely. Do not make the mistake of not cashing out. If you ever see Bitcoin in the upcoming bull market past two hundred thousand dollars. I am cashing out as fast as possible, and I'm saying, great job. We made it. This is good. Let's get out with awesome profits. By then, it's actually going to be, hopefully, long-term investment, so you'll pay less in tax. And then just let it come down. I mean, honestly, guys, I think the bottom for the upcoming bear market could be Bitcoin 50,000. If the previous one was 15,000, 50,000 this upcoming one that will be amazing, beautiful. So the prices that we have right now today could be the bottom of the next bull market, a bear market. Can you believe that? We've been advised, everybody. This is just my recommendations of what I'm going to do. I'll thank you so much for your time. Take a look at the links down below. Subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you next time, future crypto millionaires. Peace.